Hey, everybody. So look on the screen. 21 years old, beautiful girl, Asia Franklin, college student, studying to be a nurse, as I understand. No longer with us. They hate you. I know maybe some women don't want to accept it. It sounds so harsh. Because you have positive, like I did, dad in your life, uncles. There's a whole other element out there with regard to the men in the BC. If this is in hate, I don't know what is. Quick recap, listen to this statement. Kennesaw State University students are at a loss. We were all just sitting there like in the dorm, just like watching a movie and then we heard like these shots go off. Senior St. Williams says he heard eight to 10 pops and didn't believe it until he- Eight to 10 pops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight to 10 pops. What do you think he was doing? Wasn't playing racquetball. Eight to 10 pops. Sounds like to me he's making sure she was dead. And where is he? Not the young man speaking here, the student. The thing, not this young man, this is a college student. So he heard the eight to 10 pops right here, this young man. This thing on the screen. Ex-boyfriend wouldn't let her go. Was he a student there? No. This is what happens when you date down. And I don't know him or her personally, but that's my guess. Dating down. I keep saying... They need you as a resource. They have nothing. You can not align yourself with nobody who has nothing and no goals. Especially a man. Holding on for dear life. But I bet if he had signed a contract for sports, woo! I bet he had, he'd be with Becky. Let him win $2 million in the lottery. Let him sign a professional uh, sports contract. I will bet you he'll find a non-black woman somewhere. <laughs> you think? They need you for a resource. I believe, in my opinion, it's highly probable he was her resource. He, no, she was his future. She's the resource. Is she going to be a nurse too, man? Just guarantee job, they got me. I mean, seriously, that, that's how I see them. The, at this point, they're just deadly homicidal characters to me. And if the young black man that saw this want to say we need to protect our women, protect, protect black women, I hate to tell you, if that young black man had ran out there any earlier to try and protect that girl, I will bet you a dime to dollar this ninja would have killed that young black man. Why? Oh, you a goddess boy, huh? This probably don't have much going on for him. And so we got to face it in our community, and it's all people have yellow seed. It's, it's not just our community, but it's uh, it's on a 10th to the 10th power with this group. Most people are like that, of all nationalities, trust me, cultures. It's like you can be the person, uh-oh, we're all just here with $10 in our pocket, okay? No one has more than $10. Oh my gosh, so I'm going to scratch off. They rent $10,000. Unless you're going to just splurge with the rest. Somebody be jealous of you. Well, hey, you going to buy me something, me something? And then if you're not, you become the enemy. That's how people are. In this group, you're trying to do something with your life. If you're around a diabolical, homicidal, maniac, dust bucket character, you might go night, night. Eight to ten times. Woo. These shots go off. Senior St. William says he heard eight to ten pops and didn't believe it until he walked outside of the Austin resident complex to see what was going on and ran into who KSU police have now confirmed as the shooter, Samuel Harris. So that young kid thinking he's in a safe environment? 
young black man, we're all college students. Not expecting this dust bucket on the scene. Mm-hmm. Dust, deadly dust bucket. Stop, drop, shut them up. <laughs> Open up shop. Yes, open up shop, the prison. I wish they'd open up more of these shops and just leave them in there for life. Stop, drop, shut them down, open up shop. Mm -hmm. And the shop is P-R-I-S-O-N. The sentence is L-I-F-E. That's the best thing to do to make it safe for the community because all this in and out bail for form, these fools not getting it. That needs to be the permanent shop, life in prison. We saw him get in his car, like packing stuff up, and then he drove off. Police tell us that his target was 21-year-old Alasia Franklin. She was just laying there. Clinging to the life her family was so used to seeing. She was full of life, full of laughter. She never gave her mother a degree. That was until now. Grief struck a South Georgia family and an entire campus when Alyssa was pronounced dead Saturday. It's a loss her father, Bobby Franklin, cannot come to terms with. I lost the words. I feel like my heart has been ripped out of my chest. Bobby says his firstborn child was about to start her third year at KSU. She was studying to be a nurse practitioner. Her alleged killer, Harris, cut her plan short and as a result has been arrested yeah, for murder. But Williams, who's now traumatized, says violence like this makes him question what's being done to protect other college students. If something like that's just happening in broad daylight, no, I don't think anyone should feel safe on campus. We need to protect our women, our black women. Bobby says he met Harris and describes him as an ex-boyfriend who wouldn't let Alasia go. He's not going to let his resource go. He's not a student there. Dating down can put you in the ground. Dating one of them, child, a Dusty, it's going to cause grandma to come out and sing a hymn. A hymn of sorrow. A hymn they sing at a funeral. Dating down can put you in the ground. Again, that young black man, a college student, had come out and tried to stop. Man, you, it's no doubt in my mind he probably got shot. Unbelievable. Eight to ten times. Eight. So that sounds like he's making sure he's dead. And then he said he was packing some things in his car. Key and run. He wouldn't let her go. What's his future? Didn't have one. What is your future? A dust bucket on a totem pole that's not trying to build. Hit your wagon ladies if you want to. It might get you killed. Unbelievable. So she's gone. The positive aspect in our community. But this thing on the screen is here. The nursing student is gone. Someone that can provide something to the community. An asset. Person of value. The nursing student is gone. Father hurting. But look who's here, dust bucket. Unbelievable. Sad. Rest in peace, young lady. Rest in power. Anyway, people, thanks for watching. Feel free to come and like, subscribe, and share them out. Be alert, ladies. Be aware. There are homicidal maniac dust buckets out there.